Hello. I cannot recommend Aegis Defender. The music's good, the art's quite lovely, and the gameplay is split. It's one part action platformer with puzzles, then it becomes a tower defense game. I enjoyed the platformer part and hated the tower defense part, especially when trying to go for a good score run. Some tower defense levels had no option to skip as they were a side scroller. The side events really pissed me off. I was aiming for all relics and I happened to miss one relic in the side event. I thought I could simply try again. You can't. That's because the game auto saves. I suggest turning that off if you do buy the game. Which by the way, you don't need the relics in the side events. However, getting the relics in the side events still benefits the player as collecting all in a level rewards currency. If you are trying to get all the relics in the side events, you must do this in one single run. If you die at a checkpoint, you will need to leave and re-enter to try to start. This is different from normal levels which would keep them on death. During my playthrough, I encountered two glitches that would lock up my game. That did annoy me a bit. Overall, it took me 10 hours to beat the game, and that's with almost getting everything. I don't feel like the game is worth it. The action platformer is not bad, but the tower defense part feels like it's just spamming the attack key. Sorry lad, 